What's up, what's up, everybody? It is your boy, Mug Diddy Drummer, back with some Hero Coliseum, guys. Now, today I'm doing something a little different. Haven't done it in a while. This is the RNG team. This is where I picked random figures. Now, obviously did this off camera. As you can see, I got some decent figures, but I got some weird figures. They don't all, they don't all go together at some point in the game. Like, they're all really weird. Like, you have two characters with 10k HP. They can survive, basically, anybody on that team. Actually, they cannot. They can't survive three people on that team. My bad. But here's the deal. My first character I got was Fapu. I'm pretty hype about Fapu because Fapu hits pretty freaking hard. In my, he, hits, and he doesn't hit pretty hard, but the Fapu is a tank. So I'm going to put him first try because he gained 700 defense per turn. And I have this on him, so he's going to be gaining 1,400 defense. So he's going to be gaining an extra 700. And if I go second, on top of the already 350 defense, I'm going to give him again. So... This is going to be a pretty tanky team. I want to see who he puts top middle, though. Because if he puts him top middle, it's going to be GG. But here's the deal. I'm going to do this. All right, I'm down for this. Oh, okay, here we go. No. Okay, Ultra Instinct Goku is going to die simply due to the fact that Future Trunks is going to take him out. But Fapu's going to die. Fapu, I don't know. If he doesn't get a double, Fapu might survive this because... I know that Ultra Instinct Goku, his isn't isn't level 99, but here's the deal. Man, I could have played this much better. I actually could have maybe beat you in speed if I would have put future, if I would have put speed Goku on the field, I may have been able to beat you in speed. Actually, now that I think about it, no, depending on how fast that Android 17 he has, but I don't know what this man's doing, guys, but I hope you guys had a fantastic day as always. I forget when I did my last RNG video, I've only done one of them, one other one on my channel. And I forget who it was, shout out to you if I didn't shout you out already, but shout out to you guys. Um, shout out to you, whoever commented you do another RNG video. It was a while ago. And I was really thinking about it. I wanted to wait till the new figures came out. Oh, dude, I'm beating you in speed. I'm definitely going first here. Let's go. What turns in Goku is dead? My fat boo is going to survive, dude. This team is not made for speed at all. Now, obviously, I have the god who is pretty fast. I didn't even pick it. I closed my eyes and did the random left, right with the, with the, um, not the joystick, but the D-pad and stuff like that. Oh, you weren't going to kill him anyways. Alright. Now, here's the deal. Fapu is not going to gain that plus 20% damage buff that I gave him. But it really doesn't matter because it basically was... He's there to tank and block. Now, next turn, I'm going to put the God Q there. Because I've neutralized the hardest hitting threat that he has on the team. Now, don't get me wrong. See, 2K, he doesn't hit that hard. But don't get me wrong. That blue Goku he has on his team is the harder hitting version of mine. Mine is not the hard hitting version. He's still like decently hard hitter, but... He doesn't hit nearly as hard as that one up there. Now, he has a hard-hitting god coup, and so do I, but his has dupes into him, I can tell. Because mine is level 60 or 99, and his must have, like, three dupes into him double. Another one. I'll take it, but you're going to die because the god coup hits pretty hard. <laughs> the god coup hits pretty hard, and he gains 700 attack. So I don't expect Rosé to survive. I don't have 01 skills on him. I have 01 skills on the future trunks. I just kept whatever 01 well, whatever skills I had on my figures on my figures. You shouldn't hit that hard because I think you're the speed version. But it all depends on what the God Q does. Because he gained it. I gave Rose a decent. Oh, dude, please. Yo, if God Q doesn't get a double, Rose's about to gain a decent amount of attack and a decent amount of speed. But I don't see. Like, he just hits so hard. I don't see how Rose can survive this. Oh, dude, he's going to survive it. Boy. Actually, did he put the speed one on? Did he mess up and put the speed God Q on? Oh, you messed up, brother. Shout out, shout out to your boy C Trip 97. Man, I love I love doing these types of challenge videos. Oh, I thought he quit. Okay. I love doing these types of RNG type of videos. Now, Rose gained a decent amount of attack and a decent amount of speed. He gained 3,000 attack and 2,000 speed. So what is his stats looking like right now? Very good. As you can see, I had less than... I'm pretty sure I had like a decent amount of speed going into that first turn. But now I'm easily beating him in speed in every single way. So I can really lay on the damage now if I wanted to, but see, you are the attack version. You didn't hit that hard, though. You have speed up. You have this. See, you're not the attack version. What Bay 18 do you got? I'm afraid of the Bay 18 because if he locks me in place, I'm dead every time. I want to put this again, but I, bro, look at the Fapu's defense. Like, what? Okay, I'm down for this. You're going to die. One, you're going to die from the God Q and the Rosé. Because one, okay, you're going to, you might actually, why aren't you putting them in trigger squares, bro? 
Put the Bay 18 in a trigger square, you could have put Bay 18 top left and the Android 17 bottom left, and you would have gotten the you would have gotten the posing skill of the Android. Actually, the Android 17 is going to get the posing skill regardless. The plus 250 to speed to everybody, I believe that is for him. And the Bay 18, you could have locked me in place. I couldn't have moved. And then if you would have beat me in speed, which you you're not going to regardless. Actually, I don't know. Fat Boo. He's not going to take out that blue Goku, considering that blue Goku gives himself a 10% damage mitigation, which is, it's a decent thing. When I see people having a damage mitigation and it's only 10%, I kind of like go, eh, at it, because if you put ADM up F on someone, they're already in the mitigating that. They're taking away that decent amount. You're beating me in speed, though, brother? Oh, dude, Fat Boo is about to be tanky. Plus 700 defense. Plus 20% it doesn't really matter. But he gained 350 defense from the de defensive up F. 700 defense from that. And he just gained plus 20% damage. He's not going to take out the blue Goku no matter what. Because the blue Goku has the 10%, as I said. So he'll only be hitting 10% harder. I'll take this damage. I didn't really need to use the this trunks. I was just very nervous to just throw the trunks out there. Even though he is going to die because the god Ku just got that plus 700 attack. And he got a... I feel like he got another buff that I... Like a... If you go second, the SEC skills. I'm not so sure about it, though. I don't think... I think I put speed up B, attack up B, and ADM up B. So he didn't have the attack up um, attack up SEC where it's plus 1,000. Dude, tank, bro. You're tanky. You're going to die from the blue Goku, but still. That is stupid. She hits hard, though. She has, like, a decent amount of attack. And he just doesn't have any HP, and he just bought, he's just tanking it. You're going to die, though. Without a doubt, you're dead. How much is he going to take, though? Only 1,800 from a figure with 7,000 attack and a plus 30% damage buff. That is how hard, that is how much, ta that's how tanky he got. Oh, dude. Nah, I'm good. I'll let the Gaku kill you, brother. I'll let the Gaku kill you, brother. GG! See, God, dude. And this is, this is a random team I got. These are people that I really wouldn't necessarily put on a team. It's not a bad team. It basically is an all go to the left, hide the Rosé or hide the God Coup, and there you go. Literally, that is the team that I got because I literally just held down the buttons and waited for an odd number amount of seconds for it to actually happen. What happened? Okay. I haven't looked at my phone in a while in a video, but I had to, guys. But I'm going to hop into another fight. I hope to catch you there. Hopefully, I don't hop into this, man, because this is, like, the second time I've seen him. But I hope to catch you guys in that second fight. All right, guys. We're back, everybody. And we're hopping into, obviously, the other, the other part to this RNG battle. Now, guys, the crazy thing about the team that I got randomly is that, like, I generally was shocked. First of all, the Fapu, I was like, all right, this ain't going to be that good of a team, even though I'm a big fan of the Fapu. I love the Fapu. He's a very underrated figure. Okay. Well, this doesn't really matter then, does it? Because I'm going to body you. You're not beating me in speed ever. Um, yeah, you're not beating me in speed ever. I'm just going to bow to you and body you. It doesn't really matter. It is what it is. You fight who you fight. I really can't do anything about it. I actually want to do this. Man. I can't. Okay. Plus 10% damage up by allies on the left and right. Man, he. you don't get it from him. You get it from him, but that's it. You hit hard regardless. Let's be honest with each other. So let's do that. Let's do that. And then let's do... Let's do that. I like that idea. All right. This is chilling. Now, here's the deal. Goku's going to hit pretty hard. He's going to have a 20% damage buff. Actually, yeah, he's going to have a 20% damage buff because he isn't getting that 5% from... That's actually very good. That SR Vegeta is a very good SR Vegeta. Probably one of the best. That posing skill is very good. Plus 1,000 attack and plus 300 attack to all allies. I don't know if it stays. I know it said on the field. And I don't know if it said that turn only. I didn't I didn't read it that fast, guys. But one thing I want to say is thank you guys so much for 1,000 subs. I hope you guys had a fantastic day as always. I will never, I will never, I always say like, comment, and subscribe, guys. But you guys can do whatever you want. Ooh, Fat going to survive, though. Fat, yeah, Fat going to survive just because he has an overwhelming amount of defense. And that God Q is going to survive because he has 10k HP. He has 10k HP, guys. I just pulled... I pulled two dupes of him in my latest summoning video, the greatest, my greatest summoning video ever. And 
I got his HP to 10k. I wanted to get his HP to 10k, and then whatever I get else after that, I'm going to put it into his attack, because I really don't care about his speed. He's not really a speed figure for me. He's more of a figure like I can put top middle and then hide like a better figure in the back middle, like an Android 17 or a attack Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Wow, you're surviving this. You're not going to take out that Vegeta. Um, Fapu's not going to take out that Vegeta, but he's going to hit decently hard, though. Yeah, you're not taking him out either. Cooler, what are you doing? Shout out to Furzo, I believe it is. Fuzzo? Oh, what is your name? I'm so I'm so sorry, dude. But shout out to you, bro. You know who you are. XX Fuzzo or Furzo. Shout out to you, man. You are an insane Hero Coliseum player. He sends me the craziest things that he does. He literally had a friend in him. Helped him out with this, obviously. He got an insane amount of attack out of Cooler. He got... You're going to survive that, of course. He's, he gets in, he got an insane amount of attack out of Cooler. He got an insane amount of attack out of Rosé. That, he literally, check him out, guys. I don't know if he has a YouTube channel, like a uh, channel that he posts, but shout out to him. Shout out to you, bro. You're, uh, I, I don't, if you're a subscriber, you're a subscriber. Shout out to you, man. I'm pretty sure you are. But we have some pretty good conversations in the PSN. Um, bro, 4,000 defense. Why are you that tanky? I understand why, but it's like, Chill, dude. I'm actually pretty upset. Oh, he's only level one for you. Okay. I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have even fought you. Shouldn't have even fought you at all. Let's just do that. And then let's just do... Let's just do that then, right? Okay, so here's the deal. Ultra Instinct Goku's gonna die. His Goku's gonna die. I could have honestly put Goku top middle again. Hopefully, and then put the future Trunks top middle. And then the God Cube bottom middle had the future trunks kill him right there, and then the future and then the God Cube might have been able to take out his master with a double because a double from him will body most masters, guys. But hope you guys had a fantastic day. As always, I'm pretty sure I said that, guys. But I will be doing. I know I said this before, but I will be doing a list of the highest of the best O1 skill figures, best O1 skill figures in the game because. O1 skills are so crazy in this game. Obviously, I have O1 skills on the future trunks just because it was a backup thing. Obviously, and I did win a match yesterday on ranked. I put it in the video. The ooh, I gotta go. Do, I gotta go first here. All right, that's good. I was gonna say because I don't know if that I don't know if that Goku will be able to survive that extreme battle, Goku. But I will be doing the O1 skill figures, best O1 skill figures in the game. That's actually gonna be pretty hard in my opinion because. There's so many O1 skill figures you can use. Like, you can use O1 skills on anybody, but who is the best? You didn't kill him there, dude? What? He doesn't have that much defense. And you have, like, 8k attack right now. How did you, sur how did you survive Ultra Instinct Goku? But here's the deal, guys. Probably going to be one of my hardest videos to make in general just because I'm going to have to decide on who's the best O1 skill figure. And there's so many choices when it comes to it. Like... There's future Gohan, there's a Speed Cell, there's the future Trunks, there's an Android 17, there's the Videl, there is the Piccolo. There's so many good figures. You can put the Ultra Instinct Goku with a one skills and hope for a one shot. Like, you can put the the Super um, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, the new blue Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, and he will one shot most people, guys. But, overall, that's probably going to be a hard video. Now, another thing I want to say is I will be doing team videos on... All of the highest attack figures, all of the highest attack, uh, speed, defense, and HP figures in the game. Now that means I'm gonna sort my I'm gonna sort my uh, account from attack to attack descending, and I'm gonna take the top five highest stats. So Jiren's there, Ultra Instinct Goku's there, Blue Goku, the new Blue Goku's there, Vegeta's there, and I'm not so sure who's at number. Not so sure who's oh Super Saiyan Four Vegeta's at number one, but I might actually rank up Super Saiyan Two Team Gohan. And get him above that, um, and get him above 8,000 attack because then you will push, you will knock Vegeta off, and I feel like he would be a very good addition to the team considering that attack will have no, that, that team will have zero speed, guys. Like, that is all attack, no defense, no HP, literally just an attack stat. Like, some of these figures in this game were made for one thing and one thing only to one shot figures, like the Ultra Instinct Goku. First of all, I haven't hit 6,000 speed yet, but like I did last video, well, like I did last fight with the, obviously, the Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black. Now, the speed team, 
in my opinion, will be the easiest one. The defensive version, the defensive team might be a little iffy. The HP version wow. might not go that bad because H. Whoa, dude. <clears throat> 10k shout out to your boy rj carabello you told me yours hit for 11k i just missed you just missed it by a smidge guys but that is gonna do for the video guys i hope you guys enjoyed it like comment and subscribe as always i hope to catch you in the next video i'm gonna say guys because that would have been my third time saying it but hope to catch you in the next video guys i, I said it again to the deuces everybody